In today's video, I will teach you how to export images from Photoshop to Lightroom. Let's get started. If you want to move the images between Photoshop and Lightroom, you can easily do so while keeping edits intact. This guide will cover both exporting from Photoshop to Lightroom and from Lightroom to Photoshop for a smooth workflow. First, we're going to export images from Photoshop to Lightroom. If you've edited an image in Photoshop and want to bring it to Lightroom for further adjustments, you can start by going to File, then Save As. Then choose a file format like TIFF or PSD, which is best for keeping layers and quality. You can also choose JPEG for smaller file size, but no layers. Now save the file in a folder where Lightroom can access it. Then open Lightroom and go to the library module, then click Import and select the saved image and click Import. Now you can edit the image further in Lightroom. The second method is saving directly to Lightroom's watched folder, which has automatic sync. In Lightroom, go to Edit, then Catalog Settings, then check the location of your Lightroom Catalog folder, and in Photoshop, save your file in this folder so it appears in Lightroom automatically. And if you want to edit a photo in Photoshop directly from Lightroom, you can start by opening Lightroom and go to the Library or Develop module. Then select the photo that you want to edit. Then right-click and choose Edit In and select Edit in Adobe Photoshop. Then Adobe Photoshop will open the image automatically. And when you're done editing in Photoshop, simply go to File, then Save, then close Photoshop, and the edited file will appear back in Lightroom automatically as a new version. The second method is exporting from Lightroom and open in Photoshop manually. To do this, go to Lightroom, then go to File, then Export. Then choose a high-quality format like TIFF, PSD, or JPEG. Then save the file and manually open it in Photoshop. And you're done! If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.